we're reviewing a Two Ravens men's slash unisex stainless steel ring. This was $4.04 from AliExpress. Stainless steel is great, it won't ever rust. This is light and comfortable, but still wide enough to be substantially noticeable. Um, it's very comfortable. I've been wearing mine since I got it a few hours ago. And it's good. <laughs> that sounds like such a long time. I'm Morticia. This is my darling husband, Gomez. And we are modeling these rings. And we're going to insert a picture also so you can get a close up and um, just see it how it will appear on the site. And we will link in the description where we got the ring from AliExpress. It was free shipping, so it's awesome. You can afford to get yourself one and Christmas gifts and all kinds of good stuff. Um, these are adjustable sizes. And what I love about the stainless steel, this was the same thing with the claw ring. Kind of like the steampunk claw that we got from AliExpress. It was in a different haul of our jewelry. But um, it was really cool because the stainless steel adjustable rings are hard to adjust. Like you kind of have to put a little muscle into it. But I don't mean like using a tool or anything, just like with your hands. But it's really cool because of the fact that, you know how sometimes you get an adjustable ring and it keeps like changing sizes or when you take it off it keeps getting bigger or when you're moving it keeps sliding and getting bigger. These don't do that. So because you have to put a little bit more effort into sizing them, it stays, which is really nice. So we have, these are like the, technically supposed to be the two Viking ravens, I can't talk today, Hugen and Munin. And so you have both heads. They usually do like the torque design with the Viking stuff where you just see the two raven heads. So that's there and then you have like the fancy designs on the ring. And the whole band has those. And I would say the band at the widest is like half an inch, maybe a little bit more, maybe a little over half an inch. And then it gets narrower at the front where the raven heads are, which is interesting for me because I would think it would go the other way since the raven heads are more like things that you have to show. So who knows. But um, when you're sizing it, when you open it to size it, if you're making it bigger, the raven heads kind of stand out a little more. So um, it's very comfortable, very nice, and it matches with everything. I think it's great for men, women, whatever, just like AliExpress says. Um, and it came relatively quickly because sometimes things from China take a while. So you've seen it on Gomez. Here's how it is on me. I have my little teapot ring on too. Yes. So. It's good for like spooky or gothic or Celtic because you know there are the Twa Corbys in the old Celtic song where they're eating a dead knight. It's such a charming song. <laughs> and so you know if you're into the Celtic jewelry this works, if you're into the Viking jewelry this works, or if you just like ravens and this is a nice little romantic piece for Gomez and I because it's the two ravens. This could have been our wedding band if we'd only known about it. Like, Good point. But I'm not changing it because we already have our wedding band and it's all sentimental now. But. So Aww. pretty Celtic. Yes, it's very nice. So that is a really good price, a nice make. And there's tons of different um, designs from different sellers, but they're all kind of basically similar, but there might be minor differences. Um, we just chose stainless steel because of the fact that it's the better metal. So, um, But if you kind of like it but want to see what else is there, just put Raven Ring into AliExpress with Google and just scroll down and look. So. So the store name where I bought it is called Yaja Viking Jewelry. And if, like me, you were wondering what Yaja is, it turns out to be a Spanish word for a psychotropic drug that maybe was used since the times of the Mayan civilization, so I thought it was kind of interesting. And it's like, we like names with meanings, so I thought I would share this one with you. Yeah, we always look it up, we'll be curious, like, what does that mean? So what did it do? Like, is it a mushroom or like... Um, it's a combination that has DMT and some hallucinogenic elements, and it's supposed to give you hallucinations. So I guess it's supposed to be good for enlightenment, just I was like... going to ask if they used it for spirit journeying or something, like... Yeah, so now, it's... Is it available online? <laughs> <laughs> Not in the US, bro. I know, we were just like playing around... Um, um, my sister and I and like I don't know what we were looking up and like I think mushroom jewelry or something and then like it came up online that like you can order trippy mushrooms online if you don't live in the US <laughs> like there's a site and they're even going like may the spores be with you and I was like Gomez look at this oh my god people can trip and like literally order this online if they want to and then I was like you know and he comes to look he's like well yeah, we can't. <laughs> it's not available in the U.S. People can have weed here, which we do not, so I'm complaining, yes. And they can, like, totally have weed and get way too stoned, and yet we can't order mushrooms if we want to become enlightened. We feel discriminated against. I know! We should do, like, a thing. We're being <laughs> you know, this has gotten way off topic from the Raven Ring. 
review. R R R. <laughs> but it was relevant, another R, <laughs> yes. to this because of the store name. But no, we are not tripping now. We are just, <laughs> we're just tired. We haven't slept very much, so we get slap happy, as you call it. And we are stressing our TV show because the next episode is in a week. No, oh Lord, it's in six days because today's Saturday. <laughs> and every time, like, we're practicing, we're doing stuff, and then we're not sleeping because we go to sleep, but then we keep waking up, and like, uh, it's like the psychological thing every time beforehand. But and at least we know it'll be frightfully brilliant. It will be frightfully brilliant, which is the name of the show. So, you guys, if you're new, Google it, check it out. <laughs> Kind of a short video, but that is the ring. There's not much else to say. We hope you enjoyed, and until next time... Stay spooky, my friends.